Hello everyone, you are welcome to Anchor Network where you get reliable and authentic news that are so crucial to you. I say big thank you to everyone who has been part of this channel and who has taken time to subscribe. And if you are here to subscribe, I say please click the red subscribe button and also the bell icon. The bell icon will allow you to get notified anytime we publish any news. We recovered hospital equipment from Aquabill property, says ICPC. The Independent Corrupt Practices and Other Related Offences Commission on Thursday said it had recovered hospital equipment meant for constituency projects on the premises of Mma Obot Foundation, allegedly belonging to Senator Goswe Akbabu. In a statement signed by his spokesperson, Rashida Ukudua, the commission said it also recovered six tractors from a farm belonging to Senator Issa Misao, who represented Bauchi Central Senatorial District. The anti-graft agency said it recovered the items during its ongoing tracking of constituency projects around the country. It said the six tractors recovered from Misao were meant to be used by farmers in the six council areas of the Bauchi Central Senatorial District. The ICP said the CPTG assessments and renew of constituency projects across Nigeria by the Commission and its partners, Nigeria Institute of Quantity surveyors, Bureau of Public Procurement, Budget Office of the Federation, Premium Times, Budget and Udeme.ng is aimed at ensuring satisfactory execution of all constituency projects across the country. It has so far led to multiple recoveries of items, hospital equipment, vehicles, and funds. It has also forced many contractors who it had to add abandoned projects to return to site to complete them. Among the recoveries so far made by the CPTG team at the dialysis machine, ECG monitor, oxygen regulator, and steel machines, generators, and other hospital equipment meant for a cottage hospital in Ukana, SN Udim local government area of Akwaibom State. From the premises of Uma Obot Foundation, alleged to belong to Senator Goswe Akwabiu, the ICPC said the tractors recovered from Misao were part of items meant to be bought from the sum of 430 million naira to help farmers in its senatorial district. It added the tractors formed part of the 430 million naira contract for the supply of pumping machines and other agricultural machinery to farmers in the senatorial district, which was awarded in 2015 by the federal government as part of the senator's constituency projects across the nation. The CPTG team for Bauchi discovered that 76.6 million naira was paid for the tractors in December 2015 and supplied in March 2016. They were supposed to have been distributed for the use of farmers in each of the six local government areas in the senatorial district that included Misao, Dambang, Ningji, Waji, Darago, and Janguwa. It was found out that the tractors had obviously not been distributed as required in the terms of the contracts. It's a good one uh, that all these discoveries were really made, but the one thing that is important is to be able to follow this thing through to the end of the day, you know, to follow it through, you know, to a logical conclusion, not that they will just come and say all of this is in the pages of newspaper. At the end of the day, everything will be swept under the carpet. We've had a lot of Things we have a lot of even things that are even more than this, things that are huge more than this. The ecoe money, the whatever, all of those things up to today. All those ones, all these ones are just initial gra gra. At the end of the day, everything will be swept under the carpet. Carpet. And this is the same president that is fighting corruption. He surrounds himself. He's so, you know, he's so comfortable with all the people having one uh, uh corruption charges or alleged corruption, you know, against them. Even the Oshomo Letu, that one, the allegation is heaped in you know, those states. They don't even bother to even look into it. They don't just want to say anything about it. We don't even know who is deceiving who. People will say PDP and APC, they are the same. But the annoying thing there is that the same president that was talking about a fight against corruption, the only thing he understands, the only language he speaks, the only thing he talks about, I will fight corruption. Is this how to fight the corruption? Because even all of this, all these things that they are even exposing, they shouldn't even tell us that uh, uh, at least they are exposing them. Even the 
the, during the time of Obasanjo too, we saw all of these things. At least a typical example is the the, the former IG of police, Tafa Balogo. He went to jail. So he was not spared. It's not as if he was a he was a former. Then he was seen in government. He was seen in service before he was he, he, they arrested him. You know, it's you know, history, history was made. So what are we talking about? After all, it is even the PDP that established all this uh, ICPC and uh, EFCC. So what are we talking about? And the few the few cases they made that time, they made some people to to pay for it, if not for any other persons. This uh, 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 the former IG of police, this Tafa Balogun we are talking about. So they should not come and bubble us out. They are they are exposing a lot of things. All the things that they have exposed, what happens to them? What happens to them? What can they say about of all of those things? The same apabio that the people, his people have already, you know, they they've written to the the, the president that this man shouldn't be given uh, any position. It was it's the same APC because they, they work together during the election. So nobody should come and tell us hey, it is the people that do not want his progress. But even before now, even before that time, before he joined PD, uh, APC, nobody is saying a PDP is, uh, is clean or they are saints. We know the kind of people they are. And, you know, they came and apologized. They accepted their wrongs. They came to apologize. So we know the stuff they are made of. If they have changed, that one is a different ball game entirely but we know this the stuff they are made of so they are not denying it so these people now they are telling us that uh, they are better off and they will be denying it even when you are seeing white they will tell you it's black when you say some anything again they will tell you you are against the government you are not patriotic you are not a, a you are not nationalistic that you this and this and that all manner of names you are enemy of the state you are this and that those are the things they will be telling you they will not own up to their to their to their mistakes they are so comfortable. Like somebody will say, you say you don't eat beans, but you love my man, you love, you love Akara. So what are we talking about? So this, this is just a deceit. We've heard, this is not a, a big deal. It's not new. It's not news. But at the end of the day, these people, of course, they are still innocent until proven guilty. But like what they said, now, all the projects, all the things that they have budgeted, they have talked about, that they ought to have distributed them up to until now. They are still hanging and they are still being seen in their custody. What are they doing with it? We are in 2019, something that was budgeted for since 2015 and it was, you know, uh, it was given out by 2016. So 2016 to 2019, how many years? So what are they still doing? And the farmers will be waiting. We have heard a lot of things about on how they want to help farmers or on how to give the farmers loans. But what has happened? Those ones are still waiting. They will just wait in vain see all the discoveries now see all the things that these guys are doing and they will they will come out and be telling you that they are leaders oh it is a pity nigerians it is a pity this we have a, a lot of thieves a lot of rogues they are the one controlling us they are the one leading us so what kind of example are these kind of people what kind of mentoring are they going to be giving the younger ones after all they will tell you oh before you can join politics you need to go and start from a local government you need to learn you need to be groomed so is this are the, these are the things that they want to groom people, uh, you know. They want to group, groom the youth. They will tell you, go and start from local governments. What are they learning? What are you learning? It's even better not for you not to even have ex experience when it comes to politics because you must have learned nonsense. You must have learned rubbish. These are the things you must have learned because you have to go through all those processes for you to be able to cover up some things, for you to be able to pad budget, for you to be able to, 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 to do all manner of illegalities. The law will not catch up with them all. Let's say, for example, it's just an ordinary person on the on the on the on the on the road on the streets, just ordinary Nigeria. You will see that before before one month, before two weeks, the person will be thrown into jail. But all these ones, they are going nowhere. We know it. It is only God that is just the last hope, because even when they, they will just do a manner of manipulations before you know they will get a, all this a son, all the senior advocate of of Nigeria, they will get them to to to. To do their biddings, they will go to court, they will twist a manner of or whatever because they have the money. But if it were to be ordinary Nigeria, God help you. Jail, 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 jail. You'll be jailed forever. Everything now, they will come tomorrow and debunk it. But if it were to be ordinary person, they will want to set up committee. They want to go through to see the end of the whole thing. But with all these ones, ah, for the fact that they are, they are with uh, the ruling party, forget it. Forget it. We should not even hide anything. We should not hide anything. Even what this one say, they could be your initial gra gra just to, you know, to just to, uh, you know, make it seem that they've started fight, 
against a, a corruption. They've started fight this a fight against corruption. That is all of, we know all of these things. So nobody can move us until they bring everything to, to logical conclusion. And the people involved should come and explain themselves and they let them, you know, get cleared on this matter. So guys, that's just my own opinion. I would like to hear from you whether you think all these ones are just uh, to to disguise to 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 bobo us. Let me use that language just to deceive us. I would like you to put that down your comments in the comment section. Bye. <laughs>